Okay, so I have the Indominus Rex out of the box, and I have, okay, I have this guy, so we can test him, put him in his mouth. Okay, so let's see the buttons. First, got the tail, this part doesn't move. Tail doesn't move. The legs, they can move it up that high, like that. And another thing I notice, it's neck. When you put it up, it's neck goes up. But when you put it down, it's neck goes down. And um, I like, I really like, this is a very good job by Mattel. It's like gray on, like dark gray on the top. Then more to going down when it's like light gray. And then right here, it looks like it has like a bunch of scales. And I like... Now right there, it's like dark, and the eyes match its evilness perfectly, and it's got like these horns, I like this part, very good job, when you open the mouth, there's like these things, so it looks like it's actually opening its mouth, the inside looks very cool, the teeth, like go, teeth, are very perfect like there's a set on the bottom and a set on the top if you close its mouth they fit perfectly and then about the arms let's see the arms now okay so you, you can put this down like that grab it down like that put it up and put the arms up higher so you can put the arms up higher. It's grabbing its face. Put them lower. Get them spread. Them out big. Put them out like that. Grab someone. And yeah. That's like the arms. I like how the claws. Let me put it up a little so you guys can see a bit better. The claws, like these two, these three right here are both short, and then these things are like long. Looks like a palm of the hand, like the actual hand palm. And yeah, has like spikes. Has like some spikes going across its back. Up to right here. Test that button in a second. Its feet are very big. It has like the gray for the toenails, dark gray, blackish. It has like the scales going down. And yeah, so let's test this button. notice there is some red right here when you if you just open it no red but if you go really fast there's a lot of red okay let's compare it to the Mattel epic roaring t-rex I just drew some blood on its face out. Okay, so as you can see, T-Rex is, as they say in the movies, smaller, or they say that the Indominus Rex is bigger than the T-Rex, and Mattel obviously watched the movie, so they obviously know. If you guys can, if you guys can tell, the Indominus Rex looks much bigger. Well, not much bigger, but definitely bigger. Um, so with the Epic Roaring T-Rex, it has, like, the neck, this part of the neck moves, that. But with the Anonymous Rex, this one moves, which is not disappointing. Looks very much like the T-Rex. Has a nice jaw action. You can, like, bite it like that. Then it's got tail that moves 
that moves the head up and down, side to side, up and close. That's the comparison. The arms are very tiny. Let's see them roaring at each other. I took the batteries out of this one because I play with it a lot because it's very awesome. I think I play with it a lot and I don't really like like the Indominus Rex. It sounds like it's chomping, but with if the T Rex, it's an epic roaring T Rex. So like in the movie, you're supposed to like pose it like that, and open its mouth, like this shakes. So if I'm fighting dinosaurs with it, then it doesn't really work for that. And so yeah, let's see if it can bite its face. Oh, I just got that, that T-Rex is not having a good day. Okay, so this is what the Indominus Rex can do. Now oh, check this out. The Indominus Rex can eat the T-Rex's face. Mom. Oh my. Yes. Very cool. T-Rex feet are a lot smaller. Whoa, this figure is big. And we bought two. Dominus Rexes. So, this is my personal one. This one is the one I'm reviewing, and it's gonna go to my brother. So, that's that one over there is mine. That one's gonna go to my brother that I'm reviewing right now. And so let's keep going with the Indominus Rex. We got this action figure right here. The Indominus Rex is gonna, I'm gonna see if I can grab it and then I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to swallow it. Well, I already know it can swallow, but here you go. Woohoo, it almost got it. Ooh, we got it, almost got it. Okay, let's pull this back up. Three, two, one. Okay, we got it. Keep that hold. It can hold it. It can hold him. And then it drops him. Then we're gonna pretend it takes him, throws him up in the air. Wow, that's actually pretty cool. It can completely close its mouth. See, I can't squeeze it. It's not like, it's not like open like that. I can still squeeze it. It's fully closed. When you open it, you can just see his feet. That is very cool. Let's see if I can grab the T-Rex. T-Rex's head down like that. And, oh, and just pull it out. And it can even bite another dinosaur while there's a guy in his mouth. Ooh, it fell off. Okay. And if you guys didn't know, if you have dinosaurs that aren't like ruined, like if you ruin them. Well, not if you ruin them, but if you ruined that right there. That is the scanning app. It's, I think it's called Jurassic World Facts. 
And so you scan it, and then on the game, you get the dinosaur, and then you can see, like, facts about it. It's really cool. So that's all I have to, to let's see. Yep, that's all I have for today. Detail, very good. Has, like, the scales. Scale right, effect right there. And then right there it has, like, the spiky things. And then these spikes, kind of like horns, like the Carnotaurus. Very nice paint job. So, yeah, this is very good. It's rough right here. I like that. Very rough on his feet or thighs. That's all I have for today. See you guys in the next video.